First of all, my mission is uh, to promote a spirit of uh, social responsibility among uh, young people around the world and also to encourage a spirit of uh, volunteering among uh, these very young people. And uh, my expected outcome is uh, my expected outcome is to see a number of young people taking up social responsibility, to see a number of young people uh, harnessing social entrepreneurship. Personally, I also would like to gain a lot of experience, learn from a number of people, uh, experience various cultures, but at the same time I want to add value to people's lives, uh, for people to find that they can actually do something. To share my story with uh, a number of unprivileged people uh, and make them realize that each one of us can do something in their life. Mm -hmm. yeah. So what do you expect is going to be the result of this? Do you expect some, maybe other co uh, companies joining you for facilitating these young people or facilitating your work? Or do you expect that you're going to form maybe groups of young people committed to social responsibility? First of all, I uh, expect to have a number of projects around the world uh, with young people uh, pushing them forward to promote social responsibility and social res uh, entrepreneurship. Mm. Uh, a number of projects uh, uh, that look to develop communities. So that's one of the things that I'm going to be trying to tell uh, to the young people and encourage them to do. Mm. So at the end of my year, I expect to see these projects uh, growing up. Secondly, um, uh, we'll be, I will be meeting with um, a number of world leaders in uh, business and also in the economy. So I'm expecting a number of uh, people to join social entrepreneurship, a number of uh, businessmen to uh, take up a social entrepreneurship and also to support the young people that are carrying on these uh, activities of mm. developing their own communities. Mm. Could you tell us the countries you're visiting and uh how long this is going to take you? I'll be visiting at least three countries on each continent, in about six continents. And uh, in each country, I'll spend a, uh, about three weeks. In Africa, I'll be in Kenya, I'll be in Zambia, I'll be in South Africa. In the Americas, I'll be in the USA, I'll be in Mexico and uh, Colombia. In Asia, I'll be in uh, India and in Nepal. In Europe, I'll be in um, Germany and the UK and uh, a number of other countries will come up uh, depending on the number of conferences I'll be addressing and the number of projects I'll have to uh, participate in uh, during the course of the year. Mm. But those are the countries that uh, I have a program, I've programmed for for the first six months. Mm. You are a student at the Makere University College of Health Sciences. How do you think your college may be able to benefit out of this trip around the world? Uh, my trip around the world is going to incorporate a project uh, we are calling MERIT at Smaller Earth. And uh, this project is looking to collect all together a thousand young people from around the world and give them opportunities to do internships of three weeks in different capitals around the world. Mm -hmm. So I'm uh, working with the administration and also the student um, uh, leadership in, uh, at the college. We are trying to see that students at the college be part of the students that will be taken to the UK and to the USA to do these various internships. Uh, I hope they will uh, be able to get experience uh, from these internships and also develop themselves as a future professional.